Hi everyone, Vegas film critic here, Jeffrey K. Howard, here to review the thriller horror film Ma, starring Octavia Spencer, Juliette Lewis, Diana Silvers, and Luke Evans, directed by Tate Taylor, and of course, from the great horror producer, Jason Blum, Blumhouse Productions. Uh, I love movies that have actresses like Octavia Spencer, who I've interviewed many times, who's just the sweetest person in the world, who does these incredible, memorable performances, but then takes a role that's completely outside of her comfort zone like Ma, you know, this nutty f woman that wants to kill teenagers. And it just for her to do something like this, usually actresses of her stature uh, do something like this 20, 30 years from now, like a, like a Joan, um, uh, what's her name? Not Joan Collins. Joan Crawford, who did in Trog, or Ray Milan, who did in Frogs, you know, in those 70s movies, these classic Academy Award winning stars were doing these really bad horror films. So Octavia Spencer thinking, well, wait a minute, why is she doing this? But because it is Jason Blum, and just because it's uh, her, there's a really good chance that this is going to be something unique. And that's what I was looking forward to, something to see this incredible actress do something completely different, something that we're not expecting. And boy, did we get that. So the backstory is Juliette Lewis is coming back to the small hometown that she grew up in. She didn't, she had a bad divorce. Uh, she's bringing her 16-year-old daughter back to her hometown and uh, she's got to work a terrible casino job. She's trying to make ends meet, trying to raise her daughter and her daughter is pretty good. You know, she's a, a good kid. You know, she doesn't do drugs, she doesn't do alcohol. Of course, she falls in with the wrong crowd at, at the high school and they're not the losers, but they're just love the party. You know, teenagers love the party. You have the mean girl, you have the jock, you have, uh, you know, the skinny, uh, nerdy guy who falls in love with her. So you've got this whole dynamic going on. And so, of course, they ditch school one day. They're trying to do a party and they're trying to hang out in front of a liquor store. Hey, you know, everyone approaching, you know, we've all done it. And, uh, you know, buy me some liquor. Everyone's telling them, hey, get lost. Not going to happen. But of course, you know, Ma comes along, you know, Octavia Spencer, she buys all the alcohol for him. But then she says, you know what? I have a basement in my house. If you guys want a safe place to party, why don't you come over to my place? So now they start going over there and it starts out small. And before you know it, the entire school knows it's Going on. So they're having birthday parties, they're having kickbacks, they're having all these different things going on. And uh, she's the life of the party too. She's just joining right in there, uh, trying to be hip, trying to be accepted, trying to be cool. And we find out why, because she's trying to make up for lost time. We find out that she was bullied in high school and that it really affected her. They did some really mean things, like Carrie. I kept thinking, this is like Carrie, you know, creepy Carrie, but this time it's with Sue Ellen, it's with Ma. And uh, so she has a different motive, not just to party with kids and not just to be uh, you know, accepted by them. There is a nefarious, evil undertone to what she is doing. And while the movie takes, you know, maybe it's only like an hour and a half, hour and 40 minutes, it takes its time, you know, setting all this up. When the evil things start happening, they happen fast. <laughs> and they happen disturbingly, and they happen, it's just pure evil, it really is. And to see Octavia Spencer not only just turn on that anger, but she'll stitch your mouth shut, she will slit your lips, she will, uh, you know, embalm you, she will drug you, she will, you know, also uh, drive you crazy social media. She'll be, you know, blowing up your phone, you know, through. she finds everyone through Instagram, and she finds, and that's what's really creepy, is that in this day and age, you can find anyone. You meet someone, you get their name, you know, on a name badge or whatever, you can get on an Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. Snapchat, you can find anyone, and she does that, because they all kind of start getting freaked out by Ma going, look, I don't want to go over there anymore, she's freaking me out, you know, and now she's calling me, and now she's visiting my home, she's seeing my mom, oh my god, they went to high school together, all kinds of little cool twists and turns in Ma, so really great thriller, Octavia Spencer is fantastic in it, uh, and also uh, Tate Taylor, really great direction, he even makes a cameo as one of the police officers, little Hitchcock moment for him, uh, overall it was a good time, it really was, because of Octavia Spencer being so freaky and disturbing and doing some stuff you would never think she would do, so this is going to be a cult classic, it really is. Alright, for more reviews and interviews, just surf on over to my website, VegasFromCritic.com, find me on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you subscribe and comment below, what did you think of Ma, love to know what you thought, and also make sure you hit that, what did I tell you, did I tell you the thumbs up? You know what to do on YouTube. I'm Jeffrey Goward in Las Vegas, thank you for joining me, I'll see you next time.